This week, it's all about cheese because we're actually celebrating artisan British cheesemakers because there's an awful lot of cheese on the shelves that needs to be sold. The dwindling sell-by date. So particularly with soft and blue cheeses, we need to be out there. Buy online, track them down, go for your great cheesemongers, your Paxton and Whitfields, your de Courtyard Dairies, uh, your Neil's Yard, or any of those championing British cheeses. Uh, I'm going to be doing a sweet potato cakes um, with ricotta, track down British ricotta if you can at all. Um, and then over here it's quesadillas uh, with, I'm using an Orkney mature cheddar. Um, and then it's going to be with a white bean uh, hummus uh, and a spicy salsa. Uh, ben, tell us all about this great British cheese weekend that's coming up. Yes, we are helping out Dad with... Uh the Great British Cheese Weekender. Um, so tune in on Friday the 8th of May from 7.30 to 8. And it's all round to Niger's for cheese and bevies, virtually. Virtual cheese and bevies, of course. Harry, what cheese are we going to be uh, tasting? We're going to be tasting some uh, Cornish Blue, some Yorkshire Buffalo Blue from the Shepherd's Purse. 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 Well done, Harry. Uh, with pitchfork cheddar. As well. That's, oh yes, and breaking news, Harry. Uh, we've got some uh, Mrs. Kirkham's Lancashire Graham Kirkham uh, up there near Preston, uh, been making two tons and selling two tons of uh, uh, this cheese a week. We've gone down to nine cheeses, so uh, we need to be supporting them, Sam. But we've got some bevies alongside it for the all some serious bevies. Um, so here we've got a fantastic English rosé. This is from Devon. We've got brilliant Adnams Ghost Ships top beer. That this is the non-alcoholic version. And this is a cider, Herefordshire, um, Mischief, we love to get up to a bit of Mischief, Wednesday night at Leeds. And here we've got two mead drinks, the first meadery to open in London for 500 years. One's alcoholic and one is not. Great. And they are, of course, made from honey. Uh, so this is, uh, yeah, we've got to go out there and support our artisan British cheesemakers, lads. What are we going to do? Cheese! Cheese! <laughs> support the cheese! <laughs>